All right, guys, welcome back. This is NYC Pops, and today I got something I'm pretty sure you've never seen before because I, I looked it up everywhere on YouTube and nobody has done it, and I'm very happy to be the first one to do this. So here we have all of GameStop Mystery Boxes for the since they started. I believe I did my research, and I couldn't find anything before 2015. So I went ahead and went on eBay I checked Mercari, but I didn't buy Mercari. I went on eBay and I bought every single one from different sellers one by one. One little disclaimer though. This one, the 2015 box, it is open. That is the only one that's open. Everything else is sealed. It's open because the only sealed ones I could find were ranging from $50 to $60 and I was not going to spend that. So just for in case you're interested or you want to know more, I paid from 25 to 30 dollars average for each box you see here today and i want to talk about a little bit about each box while i'm opening them so if you could go ahead and hit that subscribe button to show me you appreciate all the effort i've done to put these together that'll be greatly appreciated and why don't we get started because i know you guys want to see what we got here so this is the 2015 Funko mystery box they're all powered by Funko in case you're wondering so there is no way of just putting whatever trash you want to put in the box since Funko did it themselves and I'm trying to figure out how you open this so this is the only open one I bought so I already know what's in here but I want to see I want to show you guys what we get so over here you got the chance to get, I see you got the chance to get a couple of gaming characters. I'm going to put uh, an image up here. You could get Superman, a Fallout character, Claptrap, or some Batman characters. So, what we actually got on this one. Hold up. Give me a second, there is more tape. The person shipped it right on this box. So, what we have here, let me show you guys. So I just noticed, so we got Bad Girl, Bad Girl was her pop, so I bought this one purposefully because the other one I found had, uh, I think it had Claptrap and I'd rather have Bad Girl if I get to choose. So you had options of some Batman, um, Batman and gaming stuff. We got a pin of Harley Quinn and we also got these Tomorrowland characters from Disney. I'm not sure what that is because I've never seen it. So it seems like the characters fell out of the box. Or they were already opened up, previously opened up by the previous owner. I'm not sure. But I'm going to go ahead and put that back in there. We also got an Anna keychain. So that will be all, our five items. So why don't we move on to the 2016 GameStop mystery box. From now on, everything else is going to be shrink wrapped. So this is going to be as much of a surprise to me as it is to you watching. So before I open it up, let me go ahead and find out what are the possible pubs you could pull out of this. So from what I see, um, there is a chance of some Dragon Ball C pubs in here, which is what I'm aiming for. So Dragon Ball or... Okay, so if I'm not mistaken, this could be a Dragon Ball, uh, Super Saiyan, Vegeta, or I'm also going to put an image up here. It could be a Mega Man, or it could be the Yellow Ranger, and these are all GameStop exclusives. So, let's see what we got. I am hoping I get the Vegeta, because I don't have a Super Saiyan God Vegeta. So, I, I want to do this fast, but I don't want to look. So, I'm going to leave the pub for last. So we have Suicide Squad, we have Enchantress over here, this is a rock candy, and we have, I saw the pop but I don't know what it is because it's wrapped in paper, I'm glad. We also got two pint size heroes from Five Nights at Freddy's, I will not be opening that today because I just want to show you what I got on the box real quick. So that's it. Actually, not that many items. Four items. I was expecting five. 
And this was not the best outcome because I would have rather have Vegeta. But I ended up getting Mega Man. Uh, black and white Mega Man. Not the worst. Not the worst, but not what I was hoping for. So that is the 2016 box, if I'm not mistaken. Only four items. I was hoping for five. We are moving on to 2017. As you know, they all say only at GameStop, in case you're wondering. Powered by Funko. So out of all of mystery boxes, what you can get here may be my least favorite out of all of them. And I will show you right here what the possibilities are. What I'm hoping for is either the Predator 8-bit or the Joker 8-bit. But let's see what we get here. Also trying to leave the pop for last, so let's see. We've got, oh, we got a Mega Man lanyard. That's pretty cool. That goes with the Mega Man pop we just got. We've got the socks. These are Batman. It seems like a teal blue with pink. That seems nice. What else do we have in this box? No way. Only three items? Are you kidding me? What a ripoff. Uh, we got, I mean, I should have known we got Mega Man when I saw that land yard. So, we got an 8-bit Mega Man. And nothing else in the box. That was kind of a bad year to buy the mystery boxes. Three items. What's up with that? Game stuff. What were you doing in 2017? Alright guys, in the comment, you can go ahead and let me know what do you like so far from what you've seen. I'm very excited for this one. I think this is going to be my favorite box. Because, well, I kind of like that Marvel 2019. The shrink wrap was coming off a little bit on this one, but you could still tell it wasn't tampered with. So, this one is kind of a Disney one. So, the chances for this one, 2018, are... Hold up, give me a second. We can get some Chippendale characters, or we could get some goofy... Was it from the movie or the show? Some goofy characters. There's gonna be a plush here of Tom or Jerry from Tom and Jerry. And there's gonna be a Pop Pess. So what I'm hoping for here, all of them are GameStop exclusive, I believe. But what I'm hoping for here is Angela from Gargoyles, which I wanna get into. I wanna collect the Gargoyles collection, which they are a little hard to find at the moment. So I'm hoping I could put that together. So here we go. I'm leaving the pub for last again, guys. Here we go. Okay, so the plush is Tom. I do like Tom more than Jerry, so nothing lost there. We got the little stars. Oh, it's open. The bag is open. Little stars they came with. I don't know why you gave me some stars, Funko. I ain't need that. So now they're loose in the box. Our pest is Count Chocula. Not bad. Is that kind of a rare pest? I'm not sure, but I'm happy with that. Do we have anything else in here? I don't think so. I think it's just the pop. Okay, so we have a pin. We have a Goofy and Max pin. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what we have. And sadly, no chase in this box. <laughs> No chase, we just got Mega Volt, which is still not bad because it's a it's a GameStop exclusive. And I did like I did like this show. I used to watch this show all the time. So guys, go ahead and hit that like button if you're not doing anything else, because that would be greatly appreciated. And that would inspire me to bring you more content. So now we're down to the last two. Left the pin out. This is the 2019. Normally, it would. Oh, it still got the little glue residue here. They would normally number them or label them with a letter so you could know what's in the box. So the seller from eBay smartly removed 
that, which is cool, because I want it to be a mystery. Remove the thing from here. So if I'm not mistaken, this is this could be a Groot, a Deadpool, or a or a Miles Morales in here. And there is a chance of a chase. Guys, let me know in the comments right now. Have you ever gotten a chase from these mystery boxes? I definitely want to know that. So let's pop this open. I'm leaving the pop for last, as always. Let's see what we have. 2018 and 2019 are the ones I'm most excited for. All right, so I got the keychain. The keychain is Groot. No chase, because I think they had the chase for the keychains too. Gamer Groot right here. We also have, we have a pin. Just a fiery one. I don't know if that has to do with Guardians of the Galaxies. Okay, we got the pass. Is that the pass? Is it? This is the pass. So this is Deadpool. Black and red Deadpool. Pop pass. So I'm excited. I don't know. I thought it was going to be a Groot pop. But now I don't know if it's going to be a Groot or a Deadpool. So we got Groot. We got um, Gamer Groot. Playing games. No chase here, guys. Today is not my lucky day. No chases here. Still got the chance of the 2021, right? So let's move on to the last one, which I'm also very excited for, because I do love the, the Venomized characters. So again, we're leaving the pop for last. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. We got the sticker, the deco of Fantastic Four, as you should expect. We've got Venomized Galactus pop. Nice. They better make a pop of this later on, because I'm with it. And we have a pin of Scroll Venomized. Nice one. And we have. I can't tell if this is metallic. I do believe this is the metallic pop pass. We have Dr. Doom here. It's kind of hard to tell if it's metallic or not because he's already like, you know, it's a metal face. So it's shiny. That's nice. And lastly, we've gotten, ha, ah, we got the glow in the dark. So technically we got the chase. This is the variant of the regular um human torch so there's actually a one in eight chance of getting every single one but this is considered the chase because it's the variant of the original one this is a glow in the dark which i'm happy to get i either wanted this one or the thing um metallic so not bad not bad i cannot show you guys the glow because i don't have i should order the the flashlight but i don't have it yet so guys just let me let me know what you think leave a like subscribe all right i don't know if you guys see that so 2015 pop 2016 2017 18 19 and 20. let me know which one was your favorite pool guys let me know which has been your favorite box on this um gamestop mysteries and i'll see you on the next one